just to make neural networks less abstract, I'm going to make the simplest possible network. And I'll take this from Python to Excel. Sometimes it's just easier to see exactly what's going on under the hood. I use the Iris Flower dataset, which is often used to test machine learning models. The dataset has three different types of flowers and each sample has four different features. So we start with four different input layer nodes and three different output layer nodes from which we're trying to predict. We will use four nodes for the hidden layers, which is somewhat arbitrary, but this was the number that I, I came to just with experimenting. I trained this model in Python with only 120 samples and made predictions on test data, which indicates an error rate of about 2%. You can add a probe in your code to print out the weights at prediction and then copy them over to Excel. I then reconstructed the structure of the network in Excel to make this less abstract. You have the input layer, the hidden layer, and the output layer. I'll take some given features in the box above and scale the values to some value between 0 and 1 for every sample. You may notice the addition of 0.01, and that's just so no values are zero. Then I'll take the dot product of the input values and the weights, which in Excel is just the sum product formula. Then I'll apply our activation function, which is the logistic formula in the activation output column. I'll repeat the process for the output layer, and the value that is largest will correspond with the index of our flower prediction as shown here. I have a test bank of labeled samples that were not seen by the model and training, which we'll test later. Now I'll take the very lazy approach of copying over my weights from Python. Let's add one of the samples and it works as expected. And we'll try another one. And also similar results. Uh, and then we'll just take one last one to round out the three flower types. And again, it works perfectly. And really it's pretty impressive for something so simple. So I hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching.